Hello, Tara from livingonadime.com. I was given this Amato vacuum tumbler. It's stainless steel to review and this safety kitchen can opener. Both of these products I have been considering purchasing and they just happened to email me and say, would you be interested? And I was like, yes, I'd be interested because I'd like a cheaper option. Now, this vacuum tumbler has five stars on Amazon, so I was really excited to try it. Took it out, tried it. It works great. Yesterday, I had hot coffee in here from 7.30 in the morning until 11.30 in the morning, and it did not get below 100 degrees. So it stayed pretty warm for several hours. I was really happy because usually I'll fill up my coffee, or I mean my tea, and take the kids to school and drink it on the way and then come back home. And by the time I get to school with the regular ones, it is cold, drives me nuts. This thing stayed hot the entire time. I was super happy to have hot tea the whole way home. So it worked great. It is 30 ounces. It's a vacuum tumbler and it's stainless steel. And the best part is the name brands cost about uh, $40. I think I saw them at Ace Hardware the other day. They were $40 or $50. This one is only $12, I think $12.99. Um, so if you want a stainless steel tumbler, this is a great option to try instead of the expensive one because it really really worked well the other thing they sent me was a kitchen safety can opener now this is the first time i've used this so i'm going to give it a try here i just thought i would demonstrate it on air Ooh, it goes smooth i love a smooth can opener it drives me crazy when you can't get a can opener to go all right i sh should have gotten a smaller can i guess i didn't think about it <clears throat> All right, so this is supposed to be a safety one so that you don't have any sharp edges. <gasps> ooh, ooh, okay, I'm happy. I'm happy, happy. And I'll tell you why I'm happy about this. So this is the Smooth Edge can opener from Amanda, Amato. And when we lived in Idaho, one of our neighbor kids he was opening a can, he was about eight years old, and he sliced his finger open. And we lived in Idaho and it was 60 miles to the nearest doctor and it was not pretty. I have always been terrified of sharp cans with the kids. This is not, I don't think there's any way, it doesn't feel like it's sharp at all. No, nope, I'm not feeling any sharp things. I would still use caution. But, you know, when kids start getting older, like 9 or 10, they want to start doing some stuff for themselves. So this would be a great option. All right. I'm happy. So I'll put the link below in the description, and you can go check out these two products. Thank you guys for sending it to me to test out, and I hope our readers will enjoy it as much as we did. Please visit us at livingonadime.com.